How to reconcile the inventory in Business Central. If you want to reconcile your inventory from the value entries up to the item ledger entries against the general ledger, I'll show you how to do it here. So here we're going to type in inventory setup and select. First of all, you have to make sure to run the cost batch jobs. If you don't have automatically inventory posting, so in the inventory setup, there's a check mark uh, saying automatic cost posting, and there's an automatic adjustment set to always. If those are set to true, you don't have to do anything. If not, you must run the adjust cost entries batch job. So there's an adjust cost items entries. That's a batch job that makes sure that all the item entries are adjusted and you can post those into the GL to make sure that everything is updated. When this is done, your GL should be reconciled with your inventory. Let's look into our chart of accounts. In this scenario, we have defined accounts for manufactured items, for resells, raw material, et cetera, and totals. In this scenario, I don't have anything manufacturing. Therefore, I don't have any work in progress in my WIP account. Now there's a report called inventory valuation. This should show you the as of date, or you can enter an as of date that you prefer. And it should be the same date that you're using in your chart of accounts. When viewing your entries, you can see the totals of your finished goods coming from the inventory posting group. So let's go to preview. This means it's a posting group with finished goods. So you have the total inventory value. And in some situations, you can have the raw material value, a resale posting group, and there's a semi-finished posting group. Each of those has a value and it sums up to a total. The total of all amounts should equal your amount in the chart of accounts. 